Hey folks and welcome back. We have been reinforcing the front and potentially thinking about expanding the front. Uh, as it stands, we've been getting territory and that's great. Um, so we got if we abuse this world, we harm ourselves. Oh sure. We're just trying to make it our own. Uh, let's see. That's really messed up. And this, all you have to get... Actually, we're talking about this stuff. Mechanical and cyborg unit. In four sectors, gain two from each resource type. Applies to all colonies. This is absurd. So that operations means primed and ready. I could get rid of one of these. I don't think I need this. And let's get that going. So if that just did what I think it does, we should now have. We should have a lot more than that. Oh, there are no four sectors here. That's why. Uh, so this would actually not benefit a whole lot from that. Uh, but this guy sure as heck should. Yeah, so we are getting these extra slots. Um, I think we should share half. And we'll do that again over here. Uh, let's see. I guess that could be another food sector. Over here we've got melee, range, double range support. Um, that's the best sound effect in the game, I have to say. So that's fully supported. I should be able to auto. Uh, bring these guys back at some point. We could go for advanced piloting. I really. Ah, oh, man. Do I have anything that costs two? Range specialist. That's not terrible. So we'll have to wait until we can upgrade him to a bigger dino. Uh, these guys are waiting. And you are waiting as well. Oh no, these guys should actually go fight this, this turn. So 
So we need to be using our sentinels more effectively. And to keep them from range. So what are we up against? What are these Funkadelic robots? Phase manipulators. Do 18 damage. They have a teleport. They can teleport somebody else. Um, okay, so they have super upgraded units versus my unupgraded units. But we'll still manage to accomplish things. I think. Possibly. Uh, I don't think their stuff jumps. Yeah. No, their architects jump, I don't believe, so I shouldn't be right. Let me double check this one more time. But none of these bounce, right? 30% more damage, 20% more damage to stagger. Yeah. These guys don't bounce with their lasers. So that's all fine. Okay. So our team of red shirts are going to come forward and sit behind cover. And hunker, so it's real hard to hit them. Too bad. Try to knock him out of cover. Great. And we could go for a kill there. Um. Enemy annihilated. This is stagger shot. Um, I think if I fire with this unit, it's going to die. So we're just going to go back and defend. Kind of already served a pretty good purpose. So we get a kill. Uh, let's see, what about from over here? That's a bit risky. Enemy annihilated. Okay, so that's four units left, one's pretty far back. Enemy annihilated. And that's a kill. Uh, I don't believe we can get anything else, so we're just going to wait. This guy's going to run forward. And I don't believe this allows me to heal a biological, or a mechanical unit. Unit down. That's fine. Oh, he lived. So he's on fire, so unless I kill everything this turn, he dies. Or I could heal him. That's technically an option. Uh, do we have a shot over here? Yeah, this is classic red shirt. Um, uh, 
Enemy eliminated. Okay, I can heal him. For 20, he might die anyway, or I can just run up, make him invulnerable. Not kill the thing I need to kill. Uh, that's all. Stuff that's on fire. Enemy kill. Should have healed him. <laughs> oh well. Now this guy's blinded, it, but this guy sure as heck isn't. Let's see if we can knock him out of his cover. Enemy king. Our forces are victorious. Okay, let's see. I could sell all this. I think I just want to sell that. And they gave us some free research. So we now have our tier 3 unit. We could go for this tier 4 guy. What do you do and why are you crazy? Serial claws. You have sadism, broken mind. Okay. You're ethereal, which means you get all these protections. You can teleport to people. Tons of resistances. Okay, that's pretty good. And we would also get the ethereal sphere. Kind of an ultimate melee weapon, but I don't know if we'd ever really use it. We could fight these guys. Uh, lots of melee. Some armor. So why don't we fight this? They're just going to let us do this. I don't know why other units aren't just sitting on their capital, but... Uh, 
let's see. So we've got this whole side. Uh, they're sitting back here, and they're these units over here. So if we focus mid, before these units can support, uh, that puts us in a pretty solid position. We're going to send our artillery unit forward. He's going to super shield. Do they have AOE stuff? I believe they do. We've got some AOE. Not a whole lot. Um, oh, we could hit the... Yeah, we could hit the there here. That's fine. That's great, actually. And we can bring in these guys in the back. Shields and something to hide behind. And we can target the Vorpal Snipers, because I hate their guts, and I want them all to die horribly. Um, we'll bring in our archers. Here. Okay, yeah, we're gonna run this guy forward. He has a lot of HP and he's gonna have you know a bunch of armor, all that jazz. That might be a mistake. We'll find out at some point. And they have a bunch of assemblers, so let's or reassemblers, so let's take care of those. Operations ready. Oh, we're doing okay. So we should be able to get a kill over here. Mm -hmm. Enemy eliminated. Well, that was pretty good. Uh, this guy could really mess this stuff up if he lands this. So please land it. Enemy destroyed. Oh, that was so beautiful. It did like 90 damage. Uh, they have a bunch of Vorpal snipers over here. Um, I think I could fly this guy in. 55, 85. Okay, we got a stagger on both snipers, so they're a much smaller threat. Thank you. For Enemy destroyed. Win the melee fight pretty easily. Enemy down. Okay. make their lives more difficult. I have to run all the way over there for a shot. This thing I don't think has any line of sight. So we should be able to just hang out and be fine. Actually, I can even back up some more. And deal our dude. So 
gonna get some of this going. Enemy annihilated. Nice. I love that. That's so good. Uh We get another kill that way? Doesn't look like it, but I can. Enemy eliminated. Do something like that. I didn't even know I had four feeding on the stack. Makes it so much better. Enemy down. Okay. Forty percent chance. Don't believe this guy can get in and attack yet. We'll do this. I could fire at him. I also have a billion HP, so let's just start shooting him. And I could heal a guy. What else do I want to do? Uh, Okay. Hmm. Get some shot in. All right. Well, that's Enemy destroyed. A chance to get a kill, and this guy. Enemy hero down. We heal ourselves. This should also be a kill. Mm -hmm. Apparently it wasn't. here. You get to jump on this guy? He has like one HP. I guess it doesn't matter a whole lot. destroyed. Um. 
So, do you have any sort of like big AOE shot that'll knock him out of his ability to use a sniper? Can hit him with a laser gun or do the corrosive detonator. Okay. Be at peace. Enemy hero down. Enemy annihilated. Okay. Three armor. Oh, nice. It's completely stripped it of armor. Enemy. This is perfect. Uh. Enemy eliminated. And we have two shots here. Enemy killed. I think we're just mopping up at this point. Enemy destroyed. What's even left? That's all dead. That's all dead. Oh, these guys. They killed one of our units. I should be upset with them. Enemy annihilate. Victory is ours. Okay, so this is level six flying guy. Let's give him all around awareness. Does he have that? No, he doesn't. Uh, animal discipline would be nice. So we'll do that. Mm -hmm. We'll heal next turn, then we'll march on their city. But we're getting rid of their, um, what is it, this structure. Not the monitoring device, but the, uh, Basilisk node? Basilisk node. Wow. So we're going to be destroying that because it's evil. Uh, we're waiting on stuff. This is kind of a half garbage stack. I just simply rush this, but it's a lot. Or we could produce stuff over here. We've got one range unit, we've got a bunch of range units actually, one melee unit. So we're going to give them reactive shielding. And we could do regenerative bioregulator. That's also really nice. Did you get any stagger resistance? No, it doesn't. I probably want the grounding harness. And we spent all of our space bucks. So what would we do? I think we're going to grab another melee unit to go along. And we'll upgrade them next turn. Actually. Can I? So I'm essentially feeding this fight between my two ally or my two factions uh, by constantly giving each of them energy to buy more things. I find that kind of hilarious and sad. <laughs> so we should now be able to make a decent melee unit. Yeah. 
And what else do I want in life? Probably adaptive exploitation at the very least. Or it could be more operational effectiveness. Uh, what does the invader do? Oh, nothing crazy. actually take this back. I don't know which one I want. I could also grab this. I don't think it matters. Let's just grab this. How much armor does this thing have? Six armor. That's quite a bit. Though our sniper should be able to penetrate it. So we'll send these two stacks over here next. I think that's it. We're sort of pushing out on the frontier and hopefully the autonoms won't destroy us by spawning a giant stack in our empire. I think they won't do that. They'll spawn it at their at their base is nice. So next time, watch as two trash stacks take on a giant walker with six armor. <laughs> we'll see how that goes.